Channel 3 reports news headlines. Hello, everyone. I'm Cuddy Tommy, pointing from the Channel 3 newsroom. Some of the stories we're working on for you tonight. 2,300 teachers in the Sacramento City School District are still without a contract. Tonight, hundreds of those teachers met to discuss that matter. They're trying to come to some sort of agreement over wages and benefits that they think should be included in a new contract. Our Brad Willis was at that meeting. He's going to have a complete report for us at 11 o'clock. Meanwhile, the winery strike in California is still going on, and now there's some concern about how the weather is going to affect the harvest. The possibility of rain threatens to rot the harvest on the vine. Grape growers are worried that they're going to be stuck with the crop because of the strike and that they're going to be the ones to suffer if the labor dispute is not settled very, very soon. Excuse me. Meanwhile, in Hollywood, there is no progress yet reported on the actor strike there. Producers and representatives of the actors' union, they went back to the bargaining table today, but they are still reported to be far from any kind of agreement. Well, it's now the 318th day of captivity for the 52 American hostages in Iran. And tomorrow, Iran's parliament is going to begin debate on the fate of those hostages. But still, the Speaker of the Parliament is saying that uh, the United States will have to apologize for past actions in Iran. Tehran Television reported still another development there today. It said a letter from families of the hostages had been delivered to the Parliament Speaker, but no further details were given. The League of Women Voters has outlined the format for its first televised presidential debate in Baltimore this Sunday. A League official says Ronald Reagan and John Anderson are going to be questioned by six panelists and a moderator. Those two candidates are going to be asked six questions each, then they're going to be allowed to challenge each other's answers. There's going to be a chair there for President Carter, but so far Mr. Carter says he still does not plan to show up at that debate. We're going to have details on all the stories and a lot more coming up at 11 o'clock. Do join us then and enjoy the movie. We'll see you then.